Hi, my name is Aaron and I'm a junior engineer at Apollo Scooter. Today we're going to talk about the throttle testing machine. So here we have a throttle testing machine. Uh, we have similar machine at the factory as well, uh, where we test all of our throttle. But to ensure that we have optimal uh, quality control, we decided to also uh, buy a machine, have it here in house so we can do our tests at our own pace and uh, ensure that everything is done uh, properly. So first we're going to start the machine and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so now we're going to turn on the machine. So here we have an arm going up and down, pushing on the throttle. Uh, each cycle takes about two seconds. Uh, in a day, that's about 36,000 cycles. Uh, internally, in our protocol document, we want to test the throttle for 300,000 cycles. So it takes about eight to nine days uh, of cycle testing to fully test a throttle in house. Uh, here we also have a counter that counts the amount of cycles so we can confirm at the end of the eight days, nine days that we indeed have surpassed the 300,000 cycle uh, testing uh, criteria. Here we can see that's the V8 throttle that we call. So that's going to be the new throttle on every Pro CD 2023 and Air 2023. Uh, the industry standard for uh, this kind of test typically is 100,000 cycles. But as I mentioned previously, uh, we decided to go to, to test up to 300,000 cycles and above actually. Uh, the reason why is because we actually noticed that some of our competitors throttle would fail at around 120,000 cycles. For us, for Apollo, we don't think that's enough. So that's why we've increased the number from 100,000 cycles to 300,000 cycles. So in our factory in China, we have two more testing machines. The first one being the push-pull machine. The push-pull machine uh, pushes and pulls on the handlebar to test the stem and the weld uh, on the stem as well as the neck. We also have a treadmill machine. So it's a big wheel with a bump on the, on the treadmill part that just turns very, very fast. We can go up to 20 kilometers an hour with it. We add, we add up to 400 kilograms of weight on the main body of the scooter. That tests the neck again, the front suspension, rear suspension, and the main body. Great news, those two machines are coming in-house as well because for us, we truly believe that quality control and doing a lot of physical testing before production is uh, very, very important, especially for the upcoming models. So stay tuned because you're going to see some videos of those machines in-house doing thorough testing on the new uh, Pro and Explore.